Well, holidays are quickly creeping up on us, and that means the shopping season is as well. Yes, and the University of St. Thomas just released its annual holiday spending survey. Between what is hot and how much shoppers plan to spend, Molly Rosenblatt lays out the season's forecast. Results are in with some changes in metro region spending this season. According to researchers at St. Thomas, shoppers plan to spend the highest amount yet in 15 years. We've had 12 what I call it pretty good months in between then and now. So you're sitting here with your holiday spending budget and you're sort of saying, geez, it's been a pretty good year. Researcher John Seltzer predicts $918 per household, up 8% from last year. You look at the foreseeable future, it's looking pretty good, so you're probably going to be inclined to spend a little bit more, is my thinking. But there may be some wiggle room since the survey was conducted several months ago. Well, I'm reacting to the election, and I'm hunkering down because I don't know what to expect. In the past several years, malls and stores had been going down while online shopping was on the way up. This year, things have leveled off and it's a virtual tie between the two. And I think what that is indicative of is that retailers, I think, are probably doing a better job merchandising in store. And what is really exciting is I think that a number of established retailers are getting much better in working their online shopping to support their inline shopping. And there are always those shoppers who prefer to keep it local. And support small businesses in the area, so going to stores like Be Below or I Like You are places I like to shop. Molly Rosenblatt, WCCO4 News. And here is how survey shoppers rank their gift choices. Number one, gift certificates. Two, travel and events. And number three, cash. Chris is here.